For 70 years, Dow Chemical has relied on this complex of plants in Freeport to produce more than 5,000 of the company's products. It's our largest manufacturing site for Dow. It's also the largest chemical complex in the world. The critical ingredient in the production chain is water. And the 2011 drought highlighted what could be the facility's biggest threat. We were looking at a crisis with the drought. Dow appointed Doug Whipple as its water strategy director who, along with engineer Tim Finley, were tasked with the goal of immediately cutting water use by 10 percent. Their first step, reaching out to employees. We operate a fairly complex facility. It's got 60 or so manufacturing plants, and nobody knows the water use in those plants better than the operators who run them. 267 suggestions came to us. We pulled together people from uh, all over the Dow world. Dow implemented more than 100 of those suggestions. These ranged from replacing fresh water with seawater for some processes to improving maintenance of older lines. The plant also collaborated with the city of Lake Jackson. Just bisect the pipeline that was already in place and put the uh, same effluent right back in as reclaimed water into their canal system. To reuse treated wastewater that previously was returned to the Brazos River. We're reclaiming three and a half to four million gallons of water a day. Dow met its 10% goal while also defining a new approach to managing the region's most precious resource. It is a finite resource, it is limited, and if not managed correctly, you could run out. You've got to design water supplies for drought conditions, not the condition when rivers are full. 